We've made it to Walmart. I don't want to get out of my car. It's warm. And it's cold outside. Minus six. It feels a lot colder than that though. But we are here. We must go. Oh yeah, I took my... We don't need much in here, but I can always find stuff. So, it's basically I come here to get the couple things that I need waiting for Costco to open. So, here we go. In through my purse. Hello. Oh my god. Usable bag. And we're off. shampoo. I am going to try that hair stuff eventually. Just not right now. What are this? Metallic lip kit. Ooh. The powder and the color. Sounds cool. Super stay matte ink. I was gonna come through the makeup aisle. Always. Come back. So I feel proud of myself because I went in. Where did I throw my keys at? Oh, they're in oh my god, in the ignition. Hello. So I just got down at Walmart and I did get a couple things I didn't need, but I picked up. So four different things for Alexis. First there was a unicorn and it was so cute, a little stuffy unicorn. And, okay, I think it got cut off there. So there was a, the cutest little unicorn for Alexis. It was only 10, well, like 11 bucks. And I had it in my car because I thought, oh, she'd love that. I'll give it to her for like a Valentine's Day or whatever. And so I carried it around forever and I was like, no. She has so many stuffies that I can't even stand it. And when she's got her two Kema dogs, Buddy, and then her blankie that she, oh, hello, that she sleeps with every, oh my gosh, here we go, that she sleeps with <clears throat> every night. So when I transfer her from her bed, from my bed to her bed every night, I have to transfer all these stuffies. So that's what made me decide, no not buy any more stuffies then I saw this cute little like Zuma pony that <clears throat> you know makes pony noises and moves like a pony and whatever super cute <clears throat> I picked that up and then I picked up Hatchimals Easter basket thingy that I thought oh Easter and then oh there's this new baby thing that is suppo supposedly walks or something and sounds like a baby and I thought oh she loved that now I had them all I price checked them all and they weren't expensive but I still said no she does not need this I'm not getting it so I did not oh there's a good parking spot there I'm at Costco so I'm proud of myself for that but I will go back where am I going I will go back and pick this stuff up Ooh, perfect parking spot um, for Easter, for sure. So, anyway, now we're at Costco. Last stop, Costco. I'm still hoping they have those $12 leggings still on, but I don't see them. They're the best leggings ever at Costco, $12.99. Maybe they sold all over them. I don't see them anywhere. Man, they're not here anymore. Too bad. 
I found them. There's no black ones left to my size, but it's okay. Blue will do. I'm so happy. I lost my list. So now I don't know if I have everything I needed. I think I do, but I lost my list. Anyway, let's try out this chair. Is this, this is the chair that I wanted. Look, so it's got the armrest. You shove all your stuff in there, cup holders, and then this is the best part down here. Can you see this? So you plug in your, like I have my phone plugged in there and it can be charging. This is the chair that I want. How much is it? Let me see a tag. So, no, how much is this chair? I want it. Time to go home. Time to go home. So, got everything that we needed from Costco, hopefully, because like I said, I lost my, I lost my, uh, list. I lost it. Don't know why it must have fallen out or I dropped it or whatever. So, I think that's it. Now I'm just going to go home and, uh, I'm going to do a haul for you guys so you can see what I got from Walmart, Walmart and Costco, if I can form my words. And... Not sure if I'll be doing too much. I'm not going to work tonight, so we are going out for wings. Maybe I'll try to. I'll do. Um, maybe I'll try to a Q and A with the hubs tonight if he's in a fairly decent mood. I know he's really tired. Like he's only had one day off. Let's see if I can get this to work for me. Probably not. He's only had one day off. I'll just hold it while I sit here for a minute. Um, in 13 days, so. He's getting pretty tired, which is one of the reasons I took today off. One, I'm frustrated. And two, um, I want to be home with the family. He's exhausted. I feel bad. So I'm going to stay home with them tonight and take care of the family. And to be honest, stress is starting to get to me about it. So... If my family's not happy because I'm not home, then I'm not happy. So I'm going to figure it out. I'll probably go home. Actually, when I go home, after I do the haul, I'm going to go online and fill out some more um, job applications. I'm going to see if there's, see what's out there, apply for some jobs that are mainly day jobs. And fingers crossed that I get something. That was hard. Everybody wants a day job, obviously, and everybody wants a Monday to Friday, 9 to 5. But, uh, we'll see. Gotta try. Gotta get home. Gotta keep the family happy. That's the goal. Anyway, um, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.